I go over there and I almost die. Okay, I died when I went over. I died a lot in this section. So this is a section of a tree. With these. And these are just different dates throughout history in which this tree had survived. The most important one being the 1971. Yeah, the Bright Falls Mining Company closes its doors after volcanic eruption below Cauldron Lake. Uh, and Cauldron Lake uh, is where the cabin is supposed to be. But uh, according to the history of everyone else here, they say that the eruption is the reason why uh, there's no longer an island there. But Oma, if it's no longer there, how were we on it? Oh, fucking magic. <clears throat> okay. Okay, and here's me struggling to get back. For a moment, I was gonna say, like, why don't you just pop him to get away? And I'm like, oh yeah, you have nothing. But look at him, he just disappears. Oh look, a nice little manuscript. That we're not gonna read. That we're not gonna read. Hey, look, cable cars. That should be fun. Here we go over here. I don't think we, st we still don't get any ammo. Oh, and that bit right there shows us that we're in Washington. Unless something else in this game says that we're in Washington. Oh, so this place. So it does take place in Washington. Yeah, which is. Um, I, it, it, it feels like, cause, like, for some reason, I assume this took place in Vermont. Or... It just takes place on one of those upper states, man. Yeah. Upper eastern... No, not eastern. Western states. Of the U.S. Mm -hmm. Like, uh, I've never been around, like, anything quite like this. The closest I can recall was when I was near, like, Virginia. Also, yeah, actually. Also birds. Because who doesn't love birds? Cutscene. Because we can't animate him falling. Right. And here. Oh no, that might energize a flashlight. We get saved. Come on, we gotta get moving. More of them coming. That flashlight's kid stuff. The flares will keep the bastards away. Well, I'm gonna keep both, so thanks. <clears throat> you can see them too? Hell, of course I see them. Come on, we gotta move. Why? <laughs> because that's the way the story goes. Yeah, but this move. establishes that they, they are not in well, Alan's vision only. Just keep that light steady. They are tangible. It took a moment. Well, like, we got a hint, a hint of that when we... I forget his fucking name. The drunk guy in the, in the jail cell. Because uh, he does mention, like, a friend of his looking like he's possessed. So. Yeah, Danny. But he's uncredible because of the fact that he is a town drunk. Yep. And also he was drunk when we met him too. Yeah. Okay. So, I don't know if maybe this is just exclusive to hard or nightmare mode, but he's so much worse at shooting. I just think he sucks in general. I think, like, I think his, his AI is still bad. It's the fact that, like, these, I'm pretty sure, go down in less hits in the other yeah. difficulties. So, oh, like, yeah, he's always so, like. Yeah, yeah, because he normally misses and he gets a couple shots in, but like, I don't know. This part is so frustrating because like... Very frustrating because you're not the one shooting. It's like, this is an escort mission. This is, this this is like, if you had, you know, your little brother playing with you, but he's really bad at playing. And you, you're out of ammo. Yeah. This is like a weird escort mission because normally you're protecting the thing that has to get to the other place. Then like, it's time you do it. He's protecting you. Technically, but like, he can't die, which is the weird part. Right up these stairs, Wake. Yeah. Use the players from the emergency box to hold them off while I get these boards off. Give me the gun. I will give the game this. This at least 
teaches you something you can use later in the game, a new item, which are the flares, which I actually really like. Because I still prefer the other item a little bit more, the flashbangs that you get later on. Uh, they are, but don't we? Don't I feel like we don't get those very often or at all. Whereas we I, do get them. Yeah, you don't get them often. That's for sure. You get them in some good amounts, though. And they, they, I think. With for what they do, they make up for whatever. Uh, this is when I realized that you can actually hold them up. Did you not? Yeah. No, I always okay, and that guy just popped out of nowhere, so I, I excuse me for that one. Okay, run, run, run. run. Okay, and that would go up here. We should be guarding him, but you know he has a gun. So. Yeah, what? Are, so who cares? They'll be honest soon. I like how they just go away. We know his voice to be the kidnapper already. Yeah. Alan doesn't know that yet. Um, I think but he I... does, doesn't he? Not yet. This is it, Wake. Well, he's obviously the kidnapper, or he's at least, like, related. Because um, he's here to meet Wake. So. Uh -huh. That's not how this goes. But like, yeah, the, the flares I like is you see them a lot and they're a versatile item. Like, popping one up, as you can see, causes them to back up a little bit and stuns them. Yeah. Uh, you can walk up close to them. It has a wide hitbox, so you can hit multiple enemies at once to get rid of the darkness. If you need to run away, you can drop them, which can give you space. Yeah, it's really good for, you know, crowd control. Um, the only thing is that I think... They they definitely don't last long, which is very uh, unrealistic. Because flares last a very long time in real life. Like how long? I don't exactly know the exact time, but they last a very long time. I mean, they're meant to. They're they're meant for both signaling and for um, yeah yeah just generally for signaling uh, like for help or for. Uh, some kind of clearing. Um, like you would use flares for like, you know, uh, if your car's broken down or if you're lost in the woods. I'll also say this about this, and it's kind of weird for the pace of the story, or I guess the, the flow, but uh, he doesn't necessarily need to kill all of these guys. You just need to last long because I remember I had one or two enemies still be alive. And the cutscene moved on just fine. Uh -huh. Which is good because his aim sucks. I just looked it up and, uh. Let's see here. Oh, wait, no, this is the wrong kind of flare. This is a, um. This is for arthritis, uh, so I'm not gonna say that one. True fear. The arthritis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how you get somebody to, for help. Also, you are... Yes, I am almost dead. Correct. Oh my god. I get I get really close. Unless I, I do actually die here, I'm not sure. I try to be conservative with these things during this, because like, I did not know how long this would last. Also, I'm surprised the cutscene didn't proc already. <clears throat> Is it you have to kill a certain amount? Do you have to kill this guy? You have to kill that guy. There we go. Let's cut the act now. Where's my wife? I knew you were gonna say Ah, okay. So a regular flare, traditional road flares will burn in fifteen minutes. Uh, Once we get you some, uh, so I guess these are supposed to be road flares. What the hell Cause these are the ones that are just Where's regular. I want the entire manuscript, or she's gonna suffer bad. You touch her all. That has to be something. <laughs> this just shows that fucking Alan's awful at close quarters combat. To push him forward while doing a punch. 
just to the face. Yeah, yeah, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. Also, that railing is awful. To just kind of break. Also, like, he ran far. He ran, Alice, and he he ran, ran far and fast. He some magical yeah. power, but I had no manuscript to give him. I had to get back to Barry and figure out my next move. I want to say we're, like, halfway to the end of this? I'm not sure. Actually, I just ran my mouse over, like, the thing, uh, did you see the, uh, like, little, like, time bar come up, or not? No. Perfect! Actually, that doesn't even matter, I'm not even recording us watching this, I'm recording us, like, talking as we're watching it. Yeah. So, like, it did, that, that question had no purpose, okay. It's okay. Also, bear traps. Mm hmm I remember I tried looking for goodies around here. I thought those were goodies at first. I did too, until I took a closer look. Unfortunately, you can't dismantle them without shooting, which means that, um... You didn't even know you could shoot them. You can shoot them. However, I wouldn't recommend it, especially not on this difficulty, because ammo is hard to come by. Yep. Like 42 shots seems like it should be a lot. I mean, it is in, like, you know, base game. But in Nightmare, everything, since it takes just about double the amount of bullets, eh, 42 is like nothing. I kind of wish you could have more. Well, then it would be Nightmare difficulty now. Uh, where does he even store all these bullets anyway, man? Pockets. He's got a whole jacket. It pockets? I guess. Yeah, that's true. But even my blazer pockets aren't that big. That and, okay, so the Taken are all live people that have just been absorbed by the darkness. So, like, when you think about it, and with how small the town is, you're, you're kind of exterminating quite a bit of the people of the town. Uh... Maybe. These are all bright. They all have to be bright false citizens. I assume some of them are bright false citizens, and some of them are uh, tourists, or like and... people that pass through bright falls. Because like you do meet a lot of these, and it'd be weird. But I assume they're like people that have gone missing over time, like not necessarily recently. Oh, you mean they're all the devs? Kind of. Because... No, no, no. They also all wear the same clothes. Yeah, maybe. Because, like, you see, like, a bunch of loggers, truckers, and stuff like that. You know, people that pass through towns a lot. A lot of people wearing Adidas clothes, yeah. Are they actually wearing Adidas clothes? Yeah, they're wearing a, a, a sweat sweat jacket with stripes and sweatpants with stripes. Is that or really? track track jacket, my bad. Is that really Adidas? Also, I feel like that was a waste. It was. But it was because I thought that guy would come across the corner, but he didn't. He's just right there. No. A generator. Cool. Try to pop that. And checkpoint reached. Don't know those. I don't think so. I think I tried looking, but there's nothing there. There's also quite a bit of uh, bear traps on that, that stump over there. Oh, and my favorite weapon, the hunting rifle. Well, used to be. But... Uh... Have I you just like the pistol. Oh, I was gonna say, have you come to accept the way of the shoddy? Well, not the pump shot, but... But the other one, yeah. But it was an old and obviously hadn't flown in decades. Looking at it, sent a shiver down his spine. Yeah, I don't understand that part. 
I don't know. A lot of the stuff is like coming will into existence. Because it seems like that plane was just completely random, and it's not like it ever gets like mentioned ever again. But he always, and he said like he heard a plane crash down, but I didn't hear anything. I didn't hear anything, but again, I don't hear too good. Yeah. One more. There we go. I don't think headshots or anything does anything in this game. I wanna say that's true, but I feel like they might. I don't know many- oh dear. Okay, you need- you need Oh, I'll nice be, one. I'll be good. I'll be good. I'm kind of using a lot of batteries, though. You are. I usually, if if I usually like, unless they get close, I don't like focus. Or unless there's multiple, I don't really focus. I, like I, like when I first played this game like a while back, like I conserved like energy as much as I could. I only really pop batteries if it's like an absolute necessity. Well, I know I flashed. I I try to flash them if I can see them in like in the middle of an attack animation because yes, it does stun them. So, you can at least have that. I think I saw something up here, and that's why I came up here. I don't remember what. I believe those. No, I just saw the light. My bad. I believe they'll stun if you just wave the flashlight, and they may stun longer if you focus it in, on their mm -hmm. face. They only they only stop. If you flash them. Oh, coffee! Co coffee! That's what I saw. That. I don't think we've picked up a coffee so far in this playthrough until now. Hmm. Well, to be fair, it's because I picked up a pretty good chunk of them in normal mode. I think I picked up uh, all the obvious ones in the early episodes, and not any of the far off beaten ones. I tried looking to see if there was anything where those bear traps were. At a certain point, I gave up because I also died a lot there, too. Yeah. I guess there was nothing there.